Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. I think my antivirus is updating at the one point, that's why it slowed down, but well, that might be inconvenient. We were still able to make it! Yeah! Oh, oh geez, do not look. At, no, don't even look. Not, no, don't. Just keep your back turned to it. You do not want to make eye can contact to that thing. That. Oh, okay. It's just we made, we made it. We're safe. We're safe. But yeah, we can't really do anything about that chest right now. But we can do some exploration around here. There's a crow. They kind of swoop in on you and they kind of try and steal your stuff. Get your bread from your pocket, your lunch, and yeah, it's not good. Maybe even your lunch money too. It's, it's just awful. Awful, I tell you. So don't get hit by the crows. <laughs> so there's a switch. There's a path. This path leads to the switch. Who would have guessed? Oh man, no oh boy. So if you hit the switch, it's like, hey, there's a bridge over here. No, yeah, you can cross the bridge. But if you go across the bridge, you'll find that, uh oh, your path always blocks. Oh no, oh no. And that bridge also does not stay up for very long. So what to do? What to do? Oh, there's a stamp station over here too. Keep that in mind. And. Well, actually, what I could do is uh, draw like a little stamp thing on here. Uh, yeah, I, I, that, that, I don't know. It looks more like a remote control on my quick, on my quick sketch there. But that'll do. That'll do. <laughs> Probably because I need to fill it in more. So here's the trick to the puzzle. What you gotta do is drop a bomb over. Oops. Well, I didn't want to drop the bomb on the switch. I wanted to drop the bomb next to the switch. You'll see what I mean here. You grab a bomb. Flower. <laughs> Drop it next to the switch. There we go. Grab the other one. Uh, let it explode. Hit the switch. I said, let it explode and hit the switch. Other one, grow back, please. I'm having all sorts of bomb troubles here. That extends the time that you have to grab a bomb, and then you can go ahead and bring it on over to that side. Now, you may also, if you'd like to now, or you, you could save it for later, but I'll, I'll do it now to show you just for kicks, I suppose, is that you can go... Why don't you grab onto that? <laughs> so you can go ahead and grab a bomb, go over here, and make yourself a little shortcut for the future. Obviously that obviously that route was a little bit too long to make it to that other blockade. That's why you gotta do the switch puzzle with the bridge. So yeah, this is just mainly for shortcut purposes. In the future you could just always use the bridge and whatnot, but eh, eh, and now you got this. <laughs> huh? Huh? Hmm? Mysterious. What is this thing? What could it be? Who knows? Well, I know actually, but if I do it now, you'll miss out on some dialogue. So let's <laughs> let's just leave that for now and do a puzzle over here. Uh, let's read this. Connect the two stone statues that face each other. I think it was these two, if I recall correctly. Yes, it <laughs> yes, it was. Like I said, these puzzles don't change. From playthrough to playthrough, so yeah. Um, so you just gotta find the ones that are staring at each other, like this one is staring directly to this one over here. All the other ones are not, basically. So you just gotta, you know, you gotta look around in this eight circle formation of stone statue heads and then find them. And so, like this one obviously isn't pointing at anyone. <laughs> You may also cut the grass if you'd like to get some giblets for your pockets, but well, that, that that's that's entirely up to you. Anyway, what does this sign say? The forest sanctuary is ahead! That looks like the place we need to go! And that really is a bad looking stamp there. Maybe I should, just for the sake of doodling. Yeah, I think filling it in makes it look a little less like a remote control and more like a stamper. And also, it probably should be more shallow. Yeah, probably something like that, a little bit more square. That'll do. That'll do. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, you can erase and draw all you want on your map. You could probably fill the whole thing with marks, like just black out the screen entirely if you wanted to, but that's not very useful. No. Now is it? <laughs> Are you Gage? Gage of the Locomos? Well, yes, I'm Gage. Oh, he seems quite a bit more informal than Anjin, doesn't he? What was that now? If you've something to say, I'd like to hear it! Oh, I'm sorry, I admit no offense. Actually, Anjin said us to speak with you. Oh yes, of course. You're the youngsters with that wonderful flute. And you're here to restore the spirit tracks of the forest temple, yes? Um, I, I, I mean, yes, of course. We need to research the Tower of Spirits with the energy of the forest. 
Yes, that realm of yours can't do it alone. You need more spirit tracks. Well, there's a way. Would you like to hear it? Nah. We'll never make it to the forest temple like this, Link. Let's listen to what he has to say. Okay, fine, fine. To restore the tracks that disappeared, you need to know a special song. This locomotive song is a duet that requires two sacred instruments. Thy cello and your spirit flute should do the trick. With both instruments playing the song, we can restore the rail map's energy. Could you imagine if it like kept track of all the times I was saying no, just for the sake of getting new dialogue? And then it just like tells me at the end, why were you so reluctant to move on ahead? What is wrong with you? <laughs> One day, there's gonna be a game that'll have something like that. <laughs> so we can restore the rail map's energy. So shall we try it? Eh, not sure. It's not gonna be unsure of something the first time you do it. And I know I should really be the one playing, but I can't in this condition. I can't hold anything. My body is just too... Okay, I don't have a body. <laughs> just give it your best try. I know you can do it, Link. Okay, fine. So shall we try to play the song? Not yet. <laughs> oh, well, let me know when you're ready. Okay, okay, I'm ready. <laughs> See, that's what I mean about all the no's. Let's do it! All right, let's practice a bit before we launch into the real thing. This song has two parts, each of which is played by a different instrument. For now, just follow my lead. By the way, uh, you might want to, just for the sake of if you're using an emulator, configure your uh, microphone settings, just saying. Just saying, also set a hockey for it. I'm using the space bar here, just for the sake of easy access, I guess you could say. I'm going to start by teaching you how to play the spirit flute. Slide the spirit flute so the note you want to play is in the middle of the screen. Then blow into the microphone to play you the note. That's what I have set to the space bar. You know, a blow sound to said microphone. Yeah, yeah. So we basically go like that. You can slide all around. Woo! Yeah, good! Now I'll teach you your parts. For this song I'm about to play, imitate me as closely as you can. Pay attention to the timing. Just match the color of the music note to the color of the pipe you want to play. Mm, uh, 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 uh. They're all in a row down here, so it's a pretty easy one. When you've had enough practice, tap the arrow to rest a bit. Alright, ready? Hold the right side of it as it makes it easier to slide it left and right And uh, for this song. Yep, it's a rhythm game. <laughs> My years of Dance Dance Revolution, it, they have paid off. <laughs> oh, I was a little bit quick between the orange and yellow there, but you don't have to be absolutely perfect on it. Well, that was kind of a weird sound skick, but uh, yeah, I think I got it though. But yeah, you don't have to be perfect, you just have to do it decently enough to pass. It doesn't count your marvelouses, perfects, greats, and goods. It just counts whether if you're close enough for a certain amount through the whole song. <laughs> Goes me, you, me, you, in that order. And don't mess up the timing, you hear? So you ready for the real thing? Yes. Otherwise, I'll just go back to that other one. Don't let my part confuse you. Like, no matter what he plays, you do your part in time with that ding, ding, ding in the background of the metronome. Listen. Like that. See, he's playing something different. Then we add... Oh, that was a little too quick on the orange and yellow. That's okay. That's okay. It'll probably be fine. La, la, la. Oh, that looking good. La, la, la. <laughs> Get the idea? Yeah. Woo! Such a beautiful scene and area, and yeah. Music's always been a pretty big part of the Zelda series with all the instruments. You got your ocarinas, your wind wakers, here's your spirit flutes. <laughs> yeah! Woo! Nice jam session. Nice jam session. <laughs> You completed the duet with Gage, the locomotive of the Forest Realm! The Forest Realm map has started glowing! Oh my, we got more tricks! Woohoo! We can reach the bull! Yeah! Wonderful, wonderful! The tracks to the Forest Temple have been restored! You are natural at that, Link! And you sounded really good too! Now let's head to the Forest Temple! Thank you so much, Gage! Oh, maybe I should have failed that, that at first, like on purpose, to see more dialogue. Well. Hmm. Well. Hmm. Hmm. 
Good luck, but be careful. The forest temple can be very dangerous. Can it? Can it? Maybe I should have got that potion. <laughs> Nicely done! The forest temple is just up ahead. Take care. Will do. Will do. Okay. So now we can go take a look at that thing that was making sounds before over here. Now we're going to hear a bit of dialogue in on itself. Woo! Did you hear anything coming from that stone there? I did. I did. Let's listen. Oh. Do you get it now, the colors? Do you get it? Do you get it? Yeah, you got it. <laughs> uh, uh. Why? What? My antivirus better not be slowing things down again, because that song was supposed to be a lot quicker. <laughs> oh, that was a nice snap! That song just now. What was that? Was that you who played it? I'll give you this valuable piece of information. Listen well. That song you just played is called The Song of Awakening. Guys like me are scattered all over the place. If you play that song, we'll tell you valuable information. Yep, this is a gossip stone. And you can also... Oh, and you can also check out that song on a collection screen. That way you can practice it whenever you want. And that's it. See you! Yeah, Song of Awakening, play it to wake anything up that's asleep, yeah, oh yeah, just, that was just kind of a repeat, <laughs> so if you wanted to try that again, you know, just for the sake of, you know, practice and waking him up again, <laughs> just, there, that's, that's, that's the timing it should have been, what, not, maybe because it was part cutscene in with it too, okay, whatever. <laughs> it was a nice nap. Is this the same dialogue, really? Uh, 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 I guess so. Okay. Okay, so yeah. If you go to the collection screen, you see, here's your song. Yeah, yeah. Got it? Good. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Take a little circle. Oh, don't look at it. No, don't, no, don't. Don't to keep it even off camera. Okay, good. Okay, good. <laughs> So we can't get that chest now, it's being guarded by the most fiercest of enemies. So we're gonna have to leave. Sure, sure. Tracks at Forest Temple have been restored! Let's go! I mean, let's go! Woohoo! <laughs> uh, which way should I take? Should I go this way or should I go this way? I think I'll go this way, actually. <laughs> because then I'll end up being able to connect to these tracks down to a more out in the open area connected to the rest of them in the future I suppose because I'm you know I'm gonna go take all the paths if at all possible and yeah beware beware oh no Skultula oh no yeah <laughs> you just scare him with the horn like any other critter and he'll go away <laughs> oh no anything but the spiders oh but they're like oh you have very sensitive hearing, please don't do that to us! And then they just go back up the way up really quickly, like, no! <laughs> then he puts, they shove like web in their ears or something like that, because they're like, oh, I can't take anymore. The whistle, it's too loud. Too loud. <laughs> Here's another horn warning here coming up. See that smoke? Yeah, that sign. It's saying, hey, ready your horn, you better be ready. It's coming! It's coming! We know spiders are in the area! <laughs> but the sign to protect the passerbys from such wild, dangerous critters, and this wall is completely flat. But yet, yet, it's still an opening. Wait a second, is that a bunny over there? Why, I am so inspired by this bunny's appearance over here, I, I, I think, I think I should draw it. Just, just... I mean, it, I mean, we might have to come back for it later or something like that. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, it's kind of a bad bunny. It, it, uh, well, no, that's not that bad. Okay, we'll leave that as that is. We, we, we know that sort of symbol is a bunny head. That, that will do. That will do. And behold! The Forest Temple, as you've seen as we were coming out of the opening there. But I just wanted to mark that bunny over there for the sake of marking that bunny and since we're only about 15 minutes here maybe I'll do a smidge of the temple I think it's gonna take me like maybe 45 minutes or so overall to do it half hour 45 minutes so this is it forest temple are you ready for it to come Link 
Uh, don't talk like that. You're making me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's much funnier dialogue than if you gave a confident answer. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. What do we have here? It appears to be a green, white, green. Oh man, how exciting! So we bring that up. We hit that button. Yeah, we have learned a new song. Woo. Yeah. That's my jam. <laughs> oh no, not Navi, please, dear God, no. Oh yeah, thanks for summoning me. It's a reward to you for waking me. I'll lend you my power one time. If you're close to running out of life, play this song and I'll come rescue you. Nifty, huh? Oh, no more thing. You can't summon me just anywhere. Only a place with a strong energy like a temple or the Tower of Spirits. So, in dungeons. Woo! And it's gone! <laughs> it's just so silly. So yeah, we got the Song of Healing! So I guess we don't need that potion after all, but we kind of might. I mean, who knows? Who knows? <laughs> I honestly don't think we will, because this place isn't that hard or anything like that. It's, it's the first main dungeon, so yeah, it's, it's not gonna be hard. We have three hearts, and we know how to utilize them. <laughs> Are you ready? Forest Temple time is a go! Maybe I'll do like the first floor that I have access to and then end off the part or something like that. Uh, I bet these all contain hearts. Should I... should I... Ah, I kind of wasted them. <laughs> if you think about it, because I can always go back and get them once I collect the hearts or break them out. We kind of kind of lose that until we leave the area entirely and yeah. Ah, we should be fine. We should be fine. Oh man, how does one get to a switch at such a far off location? Well, let's just say we broke those things. Well, watch them for a second here. Hmm? They come back! What the poop? Well, that, combined with the ability to pick them up, and perhaps maybe the ability to throw them across chasms of death, that is the down. Look at that. Puzzle solved. <laughs> you got some poison gas over here. <laughs> <laughs> don't go in there. Don't go in there. Uh, well, I don't know what to do about that, but let's just let's just go on ahead here and hmm? Hmm? Oh man! Spy nuts! Oh this is a new variety, this this greeny one. I'll I'll let you let you see what it does here. It kinda follows you a little bit more uh, intently than the other ones do. Yeah, see that? See that? Yeah. It's not really majorly threatening or anything like that, but I just wanted to show you its new variety. <laughs> and I will take that rupee if you don't mind. I just hope I can grab it before it disappears. Go, 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 cha-ching! <laughs> yeah, big green rupee! Woo! Now I can go buy that potion, I suppose. <laughs> A whopping 100 rupees for that. Uh-oh, uh poison gas. That can't be good. That can't be good at all. Hmm. What could be creating said poison gas? Oh, I didn't mean to touch it. Well, <laughs> hearts, please. Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, we'll meet the Vengas. Yeah, this thing right here. This is what's creating the poison gas. You can't get rid of it, though. So wherever you defeat them. Oh, pff, I didn't want to roll. <laughs> I don't want to just touch you. There we go. <laughs> so then... Oh, come on, why do I keep running into stuff? I'm just playing like a derp -a derp Maybe I should play that Song of Healing already. I <laughs> nah, I'll, I'll save it, because it's a once per dungeon thing. I don't. I really don't think I'll need to. I'll be able to get some hearts at the next pot station. Oh, the whirlwind! Look at this, you already got the dungeon item. Can you believe this? Blow into the mic to send the cycle in the direction you're facing. So you tap this. Use the blow button, or, you know, blow into the microphone if you're playing on an actual DS or 3DS. Oh yeah, you can also change it around thusly, and yeah, basically shoot your whirlwinds to blow stuff out of the water. Or, you know, you can also hold, uh, hold the L button as a shortcut. Look at that, look at that. Oh man, like a pro. <laughs> So you don't have to touch at the upper right corner, you can just use the L button to 
shortcut your way to automatically selecting and deselecting this much quicker than you could probably do while touching and moving your character around and stuff like that. It's I'm primarily going to be using the L button as a result of that because it's so, so much faster. But okay, let's take a look, see around here. Oh man, a treasure chest! Oh man! <laughs> so yeah, there can be stuff hidden in the... Really? <laughs> There can be stuff hidden in the fog, but, but well, don't worry about it. You have the, you have the means. I don't have a, like I'm using my L button too, but I don't really have a free finger to touch the spacebar and the keyboard easily. <laughs> okay, we're, I'm gonna have to maybe adjust some stuff, but eh, it should be fine for the most part here. I'll just grab some more pots to recover my health probably, and nope, a wood heart. Okay. <laughs> Delightful. <laughs> no, there's my hearts. There's my hearts. And remember the Song of Awakening? Yeah, we can use that. We can totally use that. I think this will just tell me if there's any chests on said area. So I'm pretty sure I got them all except for maybe in this area here. Uh, so it's probably going to say, nope, no more chests. Let's see here. Uh, nice snap. Oh, you're searching for your hidden treasure? Sorry, there aren't any- yeah, okay, so aren't, there aren't any more left on this floor, okay. Alright, let's continue. <laughs> uh, if you would like to, though, if there are chests, you can pay a 20 rupees and it'll tell you where the poop, the chests may or may not be, and then you mark them on your map. It's all pretty self-explanatory, but oh man! Oh man, there's no way anyone could get that key. Oh man! Or is there? Hmm. Or is there? Well, he just created a shortcut. So what if we had the power of wind on our side? Will this blow it into the pit, or will it blow it across? It will blow it across. <laughs> yeah, that's that's how it's designed. You don't have to worry about that. It'll basically grab anything that's loose and blow it over until it basically stops blowing. Like, you see your range, it doesn't it doesn't go on infinitely, it just goes on to a certain point and then it drops it. Hey there. Hey, 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 don't, 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 don't poison this place, it's it's sacred. Hey you, no, 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 what, what are you guys doing here anyway? Like, why? I, I thought this place was nicely cleared out, but I guess not. I guess not. Alright, so obviously... <laughs> Now, I would like to position myself, like, close to it, but not too close. And I'll, I'll just get as much of this as I can in one fell swoop. Yeah, look at that, like a pro! <laughs> By the way, those overlapping flickery graphics also happen on the actual DS, so... Uh, that is not a emulation error. And there's also a stamp station over here, which means... It's time to do a bad drawing because my brush is probably too big for this particular area! Yay! <laughs> uh, uh, wait, 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 that's not bad, that's not bad. Okay, we're done. <laughs> Let's just not embarrass ourselves any farther. <laughs> we don't have the powers of GIMP here. We just have... Like a 3x3 three three black square pixel brush. <laughs> Another 100 rupees. That is delightful. And let's open this door. There, because there is more of this dungeon. I just wanted to rhyme. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Do I? Should I? Do I dare? Yeah, I do. I think there's one more chest left on this floor. I think. I could be wrong about that. But then again, I thought about that with the other one, but I've been pretty thorough so far. Uh, yes I am. Nope, I got them all! <laughs> okay, fine with me. Uh, probably hearts. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have hit that. <laughs> because by the time I kill these critters off... Oh, bubbles. Uh, this, notice they have that poison fog. Yeah, yeah, whoops! I, I can't even shield them to... yeah. Yeah, so the idea is to wee like so, and oh, I wanted to get them both at once, because otherwise they're gonna kind of be in my way though. Oh, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Aha! There you go, you monstrosity, you. <laughs> and the door opens. 
since I did a pretty good chunk of this dungeon, I think I'll save the rest for the next part. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you then when I do so. Hopefully, hopefully. Nah, I will. <laughs>